A student uses a spring gun to launch a marble at an angle of 52 degrees to the horizontal. What is the maximum height that the marble will reach above its initially compressed position? So let's sketch what we have here. Here's our marble launcher at an angle of 52 degrees. The marble has already been pushed down compressing the spring fully so our reference line is right here. That's the initially compressed position. We're going to call that H equals zero. We will use conservation of energy. In the beginning all of the energy is in elastic potential energy. We release the spring, the marble will come out, and all the energy will be transferred into kinetic energy. We're just trying to find the velocity of the marble when it leaves its compressed position. So we have 1 half kx squared equals 1 half mv squared. We solve for velocity and we have this term here. Now we're only interested in the velocity in the y direction because we want to find the maximum height. We're not interested in the x component of the velocity. So that's where this sine theta comes in. Vy is equal V sine theta. We have an expression square root of km k over m x times sine theta. We substitute in the numbers and we find that Vy is 7.9 meters per second. Now we use kinetic conservation of energy again. This kinetic energy from the marble being launched will now go up to a certain height, mgh, and at that point the marble will momentarily stop in the y direction. Hence there's no, kin there's no kinetic energy at the highest point in the y direction. That sounds a little funny because we're talking about kinetic energy as it, like it has vector qualities. It does not. We just are interested in the kinetic energy that gave motion in the y direction. So we now have 1 half mvy squared is mgh. The m's cancel out. We have h is equal to vy squared over 2g. Substitute in the numbers and we find that we reach a height of 3.2 meters over the initially compressed position. Again, that's why it was so important to set a reference line at this point where there was zero gravitational potential energy for the marble.